Hello dear friends, today we start the season of Advent 2020. It has not been easy. The year 2020 came with its own challenges. But Ebenezer, this is how far the Lord has brought us. We are still alive. How then do we prepare for the coming of the Lord this year's Christmas, no matter how challenging the year has been? Go with me into Mark chapter 13 from verse 33 to verse 37. When Jesus cautions us to be very, very watchful. Because he compares the kingdom to a man who is traveling, who decided to put maids and other workers in charge of one man. And he says we should be watchful, for we do not know when he is coming back. Today, as we prepare ourselves for the second coming of Christ and for Christmas 2020, I want to ask you, who are you overseeing? You have been placed in charge of so many people, your wife, your children, your father, your mother, your colleague at work, your colleague, uh, uh, even in the classroom, wherever you find yourself, there are people with you. They have, you have been placed in charge of them. Will you be able to take good care of them? How are you treating the people around you? Who are you keeping? Who is in your possession? How are you treating your fellow human beings? Because you do not know when your day will come. The year 2020 took so many great people away. Some we celebrate, others we cannot because they were not caring enough. But for those who were, especially those we were placed in charge of, those who took care of us, we celebrate them, even in their death. So today I ask you, who are you keeping? Is it your wife? Is it your children? Is it your family? Is it your parents? Is it your siblings? Is it your friends? Is it work colleagues? Are you looking at even your classmates and the people you sit in the same transportation with? They are being placed in your care. I want to charge you. You never know when your death will come. Today, the first Sunday of Advent, be mindful of how you treat people because it is God who placed them in your charge. If you are able to do well in keeping them well, they will celebrate you. And in the celebration of you when you are no more, the heavens will hear about you. Who are in your company? Who are you keeping? This is what I draw your attention to today. May you never lose your soul because of how you treated one person or the other. God is so wise. There are over 7 billion people in this world. But just a few are around you. Take good care of them. And the heavens will take good care of you. Be merciful enough with them. And the heavens will be merciful with you. Be kind to them. And the heavens will be kind to you. Smile at them. And the heavens will smile at you. That is what I bring your attention to today. Who are you keeping? May this message turn your life around. God bless you. I'll see you again on the second Sunday of Advent. God bless you. Peace be with you. Ooh.